I think he's stuck. Oh, get in! Oh my gosh. 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 <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hope you guys are doing well. We are back with the long dark and. I just finished off the cooking a bunch of water. There are 10 liters here and then I have three, almost four on me. So that's really good. I have finished cooking all of the meat. What I am going to do is I'm just gonna eat all of this bunny and then we're gonna head back into Mystery Lake, into the dam. No, sorry, we're gonna head into one of the trailers. We're gonna sleep for the night and then in the morning, hopefully, fingers crossed, we can finish off crafting this um oh my gosh what is it the deer the not the deer the wolf skin jacket so i am recording this video literally straight after the other one so again if you have said anything i haven't seen it because the video <laughs> hasn't gone up yet um i was going to wait around and maybe see if we could make the deer skin uh, pants as well because that would be interesting um that way we'd have like almost a full set pretty much of animal hide stuff which would be really cool but i don't know if that would be worth it um but yeah for now we're just gonna head on through i'm quite heavy at the moment i really need to sort out the inventory especially before we head into um coastal highway and as i have said the only reason i'm going into coastal highway is because I really want some more matches. I think I'm down to like 11. Let's have a look. Oh no, we're down to 10. Yeah, because I used the 11th one to just do the fire so that we could cook the rest of that meat. I'll quickly check my skills as well um, in a minute because I did manage to read an hour, I think, of another, I think it was a rifle book um, or a hunting book. So I did that. So I will check all my skills and stuff because I didn't check them <laughs> before I quit the last um, the last video. I did cook up some more teas. I think I only had like one or two herbal teas left. So I cooked those up. I also cooked a bunch more birch teas and I cooked up. So where am I going? I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I want to go into the, um, oh gosh, yeah, I want to go into the trailer, not into the dam. But yeah, I cooked a couple of rose hip teas, I think, or oh, I cooked one rose hip tea. Um, and then we cooked some mushroom tea, some relish tea, and some birch tea. So quickly before I go to sleep, this is little birch tea I've got, which is good. I've got two of those, um, and then in here also we have this. So I only have two rose hips, but relish teas we have a couple just in case I get. I mean I could have cooked another one, or another couple. I don't know how much it takes, but yeah, I did it until the fires were like completely gone. So let me just drink um, the water. I'm glad that we have 10 litres of water now. I don't know how long it's going to last us. But, um, yeah, let's do 7 hours. Let me pick this one up just in case. I have 4 wet stones. So, I'm thinking that maybe we should start to use, or I should start to use... Oh, yeah, we need the knife for this. I should maybe start to use... Um, the knife a little bit more to harvest things rather than always using the hacksaw so that's something that I could possibly do might get cabin fever in here but it's okay might take me a few days maybe two days because I think I'll have to go back and eat some more of the wolf Not the wolf, sorry, the... Okay, so how many hours do we have left? We have 17 hours. So... Metal shelf... 
all I can think. I'm gonna leave the dam. Oh, that's beautiful. Isn't that beautiful? That screenshot was not the best. <laughs> it doesn't look really nice here. Okay, yeah, cause so this is the one that I was reading or that I read an hour of. So our skills are currently at this. The cooking one just seems like once you get it to level four and you're trying to get it to level five, it just seems like it takes honestly forever. <laughs> uh, ready times increased by 20%, that's good. Um, so yeah, harvesting a bear would be great. I mean, it's possible maybe I could get a bear outside of Coastal Highway. Um, what do you freaking call it? The gas station, <laughs> the garage. It's possible, but I don't want to like, I'm not going to bank on that. So let me see. I wonder if I can do this in the dark. No. Okay. Me, hey, it's gonna take like three days <laughs> to do this freaking wolf skin jacket. That's crazy. And then, I mean, can I, do you think I could try and get the last like four hours done? No, too dark. Okay. I think I might eat one of these when I come back. Maybe. Because I think it's pretty definite. Oh, I have no water left, so... Okay. Okay. Um... In that case, then... Let's go into the ravine. I'll get some, I'm glad I made like 10 liters of water now. So I don't know how long the bear skin jacket takes, but the wolf skin one is taking a really long time. It's like three days worth. And this should also help me with um, my cabin fever risk because I'm pretty sure I should. Oh no, okay, maybe I don't have a cabin fever risk. I could have sworn that I would have had a cabin viewers. Anyway, it's fine. Um, I'll go into the cave. I might even just sleep if it's warm in there. And then, obviously, I'll eat. I'll grab some more water and then in the morning, finally, we can get this wolf skin coat made. And then I might just ponder about there for a little bit and repair some of the stuff that I've got so I'll sharpen my knife because it's the knife that we need I'll actually have to check oh it's on 60% so yeah we could possibly use like a whole whetstone I don't know maybe that's a bit much but yeah I'll repair the knife completely I'll repair the hacksaw I might even repair the tin opener just in case we come across any tins um, but yeah, so we we should we should be we should be good. We should be okay. Be tempting to see what percent these are on actually. <gasps> They're cured. Oh my gosh, that's going to be so tempting. Should I? Oh, that would be really good. Ooh, okay. Okay. Um where's my stack of water? Oh, it's over here. That is gonna be really tempting to make those as well. Gun Loper was, I think, the right call. So thank you. <laughs> thank you for saying Gun Loper. Like, I very highly doubt I would have been able to get like this far with out the gun because I don't even think I would have been able to I don't even think I mean I probably would have made a bow by now but I don't know how many arrows I would have made I think that's the thing that I learned in the first one that 
if I was to do another sort of interloper game and I wasn't going to obviously allow myself to use guns I would 100% make more arrows than what I did it's so quiet here at the moment right wolfskin jacket is done so that one is for that one's one point I'm going to wear this one and then we're gonna drop this one here I could be wrong for leaving the ski jacket but I think it I think in the long run it'll be better for us and then let's start making the deer skin pants deer skin boots we already have so deer skin pants do I not have another one we'll do the 80 one and I'll try and get like seven hours done straight off the bat this is gonna be so good so yeah what we look like at the moment is this ah yeah it'll be so much better to get the pants and then we can drop off the jeans i know like my weight at the moment isn't the best but i do also want to just spend a wee little bit of time as i mentioned just cleaning some stuff up and getting some stuff. I won't be taking like all of the whetstones and everything with me. Um, I'll just sharpen the knife and everything. So are they here? Okay, yeah. So what do they actually do? Uh, warm, supple and tough offers a great combination of mobility and warmth. Wear these to feel like a Mad Max of the North. So two, two. So I'm wondering if they would actually be better on the inside or the outside. Need to eat. Uh, windproof is nine. Okay, yeah, they're better on the outside by the looks of it. But our sprint speed is going down and down and down. So. Over here let's drop off any bits that we don't need. So I don't need that. We're um, we're looking like this now. Which is pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Oh yeah. Because I mean. Oh gosh. I don't even have my bedroll on me at the moment. So I guess when you wear a lot of the animal like hides you sacrifice a lot of your mobility I want something to drink and soon um which i don't know if that's a good thing i i would imagine that on interloper you would want to stay nimble but obviously because it gets colder you want to stay warm <laughs> So it's like a huge catch 22, right? I guess. I don't know. I mean, I only had two pairs of jeans on me anyway, so. Making the pants was a good idea. And we have the jacket, and we have the mittens. Stuff has been repaired. I'm going to drop this that here because it's damaged. Seems so crazy right now. I'm going to risk it and I'm going to drop the other sewing kit here. And I'm also going to maybe risk it and drop off the whetstone. I'm going to harvest up a couple of these torches that are in not so good condition. And then I honestly don't know whether to try and get that other deer or whether to just go straight for trying to get the matches. I'm very tempted to just try and go straight for... Um, I don't want to harvest it. <laughs> that would be really bad. This, I'm going to leave this book here as well because I don't gear. think it would be 
worth us taking for this. I will take the tin just in case because obviously I don't know. The birch, I think I might actually leave here. Oh, the metal we can leave here as well. And we can also leave the leather. I'll keep the... I was going to say I'll keep the skips. <laughs> I'll keep the... Um, the sticks. I don't know what else to leave. Rifle ammo. Obviously we'll keep that. I'm wearing everything I need to. Maybe I will drop off some birch tea here. Because, as I said, I still have not picked up my bedroll. There was something else that I was thinking about dropping, but I'm not sure what it was. Stones I'll keep. I don't have, like, any... Oh, sorry, there was one more piece of metal. I think that's it. I think, I think that is it. So I dropped off three... Okay. Okay. We're gonna we're gonna be going for this. We're gonna be going for this. Straight into Coastal Highway for search for matches so that we can come back here and go to um gonna make a silver weight yeah how much water I'll take it. I'll take this I'll take two so we can still run I've left that stuff there oh my gosh I'm so nervous for this but we can do it the only thing we don't have is a hatchet that's like one of the things I didn't make which if we go back to um, obviously like the broken railroad will pass through that to get back to the forsaken airfield when we eventually make that trek um, it will obviously there's a forge forge yeah so we could make the hatchet then but then it's just another thing that I'm gonna have to carry with me which will be a l it's a, it'll be a lot of stuff. Um, but yeah, I want to try and kill that bunny. But I'm gonna I'm gonna try and leave some stuff here. But hopefully, I can make it through to Coastal Highway uh, before we get too cold. I had auto walk on. And I'm so glad that I just toggled it off because I know <laughs> I I would like accidentally swivel a mouse and my character would go over the edge. And that would be the end of this Gunloper series by very stupid means. Being able to craft the, a like moose hide satchel would also be super handy because obviously it would give us some extra carrying. Um, stuff but other than that it's like the tactical technical backpack thing um, which <laughs> is in Ash Canyon and I don't know if I want to make that journey okay, it's not that long now so I'll afford to get cold for a little bit If I come across that in a real survival situation, I'm not sure anything would like, make me cross it unless there were zombies chasing us. <laughs> yeah, we're here only looking for matches and if there happens to be a moose. So that I mean, that would involve me actually having to go all the way to the um, garage. Which I don't know if that's a good idea or not. I don't know if there's a good idea. There isn't a dead guy, so that's unfortunate. Oh wait, he's here. Nothing. 
never know what I'm thinking when I search the dead guys. <laughs> For a miracle, probably. Oh, work boots? These are pretty decent. I could have come here before I decided to make the deer skin boots. Let me actually have a look. And see. Oh, I didn't realise I got food on me. But I'm not stinky, so it's okay. Um, they're better for the whole weight situation, but they're worse for running. I'll leave those there. I see a granola bar. Oh no I don't. I'm seeing things. I saw the shadow and I was just like, ooh. <laughs> Food. Nothing. Some more rifle ammo as well wouldn't go amiss. So that would be something that would be quite handy. Doesn't appear like there's anything in here. Okay, let's um let's keep moving. It's, not a it's getting misty, so hopefully I can get to the next one. Before it gets to um like dark and not able to see. Yeah, it's down here. I feel like maybe what I should have done is started in Desolation Point. Oh gosh, there's a dead guy. I don't see anything under the beds. Oh, I see some water purification tablets. Guess we could take them. Okay. Okay, okay. This is not looking good. I was hoping that maybe like it would take us one or two cabins and we'd find some... Okay, because it's misty... I maybe want to stay here for two hours. <laughs> I think the only place that we're probably going to find some matches will be the gas station. Which... Is not what I want. We gotta keep moving. now fearless bunny hopping just want to check to make sure there's no bear
Okay, there's a wolf over there. Oh yeah, that's a point. We haven't come across a revolver yet. So if I find one, <laughs> it's gonna take a lot out of me to not want to take take it with us. Scared the crap out of me. My gosh. Oh my. Okay, there's a first aid kit over there. just completely oblivious I don't think I am I'm just getting really bad RNG right now Okay, we have fuel for like accelerant. Okay, candy bar or granola bar, we'll take it, but these I think we'll leave here. My gosh, my gosh. Need a hatchet to break down that. Could run over there. Oh wait, fishing boat. Fishing book is always handy, I guess. <laughs> I just want to see Matt. A lovely, like, blue packet. I mean, a sewing kit. That's why I dropped off the other sewing kits, because I had a feeling we'd come across one. I just don't see any matches. Maybe it's the type of thing where it's just like, I don't know, you get what you're given. <laughs> um, let's drink a bit of water. I tell you what I am going to do, I'm just going to eat this bit of meat as well, it's not very much. Okay. Ooh, is that Mr. Bear? Would this be too good to be true? Okay. Oh, if I could get him, like, this close. That would be so good. I think he's stuck. Oh, get in! Oh my gosh. 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 Oh hell no. Did I shoot him twice? I oh my heart is beating out of my chest. I'm pretty sure I shot him twice. <laughs> oh 
shit! Oh my gosh, he waited for me. What the hell? Mother trucker. Bloody asshole. Mr. Lake is not my friend. All those clothes I made. Affliction, blood loss, yeah. Need some first aid. Well, before I frickin' try and shoot him. Asshole. Too much stuff to carry. Oh, my hat is ruined. Okay, blood loss. Ah, I'm panicking. I'm panicking. Okay, okay. We want infection. Let's use this. I'm like shaking. Let's use this. Okay, natural healer. Nice. I am furious. But I mean, at least I killed him. Wasted four shots, but killed him. Oh my gosh. He waited outside the cabin. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay. Um, actions. I can only harvest it. Fudge my life. What are the rest of my clothes on then? Oh, 47! Okay, we found some... I need... Oh my gosh. I need to go back. I need to... <laughs> I don't know what to do. I really don't know what to do. One, two, three, four. There's no matches around here. I'm gonna quarter it. We're gonna drop it off inside the hut over here. I think I don't have an option other than to literally um, try and go to um, try and go to the freaking oh my gosh what is it called what is it called the garage i don't think i have an option other than to try and just go to the garage um what am i looking for i'm looking for one of these try and restore a little bit more of my condition oh my gosh That sucks tremendously. Oh my gosh. But I mean, we have a hide now. It's just in a really awkward spot. And I also, like, I'll be able to. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Take this stuff with us. Because it would be good to obviously harvest all of this. sucks that there's like no matches around here I can't even break down the pallets because of the thing so it's just like I oh my gosh I don't know if this was 
a waste. I can't believe he was waiting for me. This is not what I wanted. This is not what I wanted when I, like, come here. It's only 92%, so... I mean, I dropped it. It made me drop... <laughs> I don't know what to do now. <laughs> I really don't know what to do now. I am gonna have to sleep. I know it's only just coming up to night time. But I'm gonna try and sleep for eight hours. Oh great, and now there's an Aurora. And I don't have any water. Oh no, I do have water. And water. This is not good. This is not good. We'll sleep for another, like, I'll try five hours. We should get fully rested. Yeah, I don't have a choice. I... Oh, that's awful. Oh, this is awful. I'm gonna use the hacksaw because I know like if I don't harvest it then it's just gonna sit in the bags and because it's inside a container it will just disappear once it gets to zero which you know if I can harvest it it's gonna get my harvest skill up I don't think I'll be able to cook it at the moment because I there isn't enough like wood around here I don't have a hatchet I don't have a hammer so I can't break it down that way. Um, so, yeah. I'm in a bit of a predicament. I'm kind of glad we got the bear, but at the same time, maybe I should have just waited for it to pass. Seeing as now I've lost my hat. <laughs> my rabbit middens are on like... 30% or whatever it was. I'm almost desperate for water. I need some more food. So I think honestly the best thing that I could do at the moment is to just... Oh gosh, that scared the crap out of me. The best thing I think I can do at the moment is to just harvest it all up, drop it all outside, leave it all out there and in the next episode just start making a beeline for the um for the garage and check any fishing cabins along the way and hope that some of them maybe have some matches or stuff like that because i don't even think that i'm going to be able to get some bunny rabbits here unless i head on over to like the little rabbit islandy place and get some there but then i've got to wait for that to cure so I think my thing will still stand, I'm still gonna try and search for matches because hopefully fingers crossed this bear meat will stay here and also the, um, the hide and that is here so that's one bear hide down and we're not at day 50 yet so for me that's a bonus. <laughs> We're currently on day like 30, 31, however it decides to do it. Um, but other than that, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I hope that you're enjoying this and everything like that. Hit the like button, leave comments. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. And check out any of the other stuff that I do on the channel. I do play a lot of other games as well other than this. This is so much bear meat and I've still got two left to do. Uh, but yeah, thank you guys so, so much and I will see you all in the next episode. Take care. Bye.